Have you ever wondered how to build a dumbbell interchange and intersection controller? Well, today I will show you how to do exactly that. This is a dumbbell interchange located at I-94 in County Route T in Hemroyd, Wisconsin. As you can see, it is basically a diamond, but the intersections are replaced with a roundabout. This is how you build a roundabout in intersection controller. First, we're going to build our tiny little 5x6 curves around to make our tiny roundabout. Now that we have our roundabout, we can build our on and off points. That's going to be a 10 by 9. Now we can build our on and off ramps. So it's going to be 29 by 29. I will be using 29 for the approaches and uh, 19 for the overpass itself. Now we're going to build the other roundabout and of course make sure you connect the two roundabouts. Now that we have our two roundabouts built, we can now add our approach row 23, then another 23 here, followed by another 23. I'm also going to increase this to 55 miles. Now I'm going to do this same exact thing on the other side. Acceleration and deceleration lanes following uh, 29 by 29 by 55 format. And it's going to look like this. Now I'm going to do this the same exact thing on the other four ramps. Last but not least, to make sure the roundabout works, we need to add yield signs to a roads approaching the roundabout that the nodes we have created. Now, realistically, they would probably be like right here, but for this example, it's good enough. So, make sure we place our yield signs. And so like that, we have built a dumbbell interchange and intersection controller. As we can see, the roundabout is working. The people who are on it is giving, keep on going while traffic wants to enter, have to yield. 
and it's happening the same thing on the other side. Now, do not, and I repeat, do not use this if you intend to have a lot of traffic. As roundabouts tend to work better where there's less traffic. But anyways, if you did enjoy this, make sure you like and make sure you subscribe. And I will see you all next time.